Mr. Dorian Gray is in the studio, sir. Ask Mr. Gray to wait, Parker. I shall be there in a few moments. Just turn your head a little bit to the right, Dorian. Like a good boy. It is your best work, Basil. The best you have ever done. There is nothing that art cannot express, and I know that the work I have done since I met Dorian Gray is good work. It is the best work of my life. I am afraid that I have shown in it the secret of my own soul. Imagine a girl, not hardly 17 years of age, with a little flower-like face, a small Greek head, with plaited coils of dark brown hair, with eyes that were violet wells of passion, lips that were like the petals of a rose. She was the loveliest thing I had ever seen in my life. Don't touch me! Don't leave me! Don't leave me! I'm going now. My dear Dory, humanity is the world's original sin. Beauty is a form of genius. Pleasure is nature's test. Discord is to be forced into harmony with others. Skepticism is the beginning of faith. Insincerity is merely a method in which we multiply our personalities. And most importantly, Dorian, beyond all else I've just said, to define is to limit. Basil, we have each of us a secret. Let me know yours, and I shall show you mine. I mean, tell you mine. It's too late, Basil. It's never too late. You told me you destroyed it! No, Harry, I've been knocked home until nearly three. Goes of the body. Vampire. If it were only the other way, if it were I who was to be always young and the picture was to grow old, for that, for that I would give everything.